Hello there YouTubers, 2E0XVX here. Right, uh, a few people have asked me how you edit the uh, frequency of the display. Uh, if you go ahead and download the file from my 2E0XVX QRZ page, uh, put the file wherever you want to put it to and then you get this option here when you get the main screen come up um, if you've opened it up once before if not go up to open find the file open it so I'm just going to go and open it now now the next in screen is made up of loads of flat panels and the panels are here you can't change them you have to make those you have to change those with uh, something like Adobe Photoshop save them to the screen resolution 320 by 240 if it's a 2.4 inch screen and on and on and on but anyway I've now we've got now put a text file box up here so if you put your mouse up onto the text file and click it so it highlights it down on this side this is where you want to be altering all your editing if you can edit it so we're going to go ahead now and move down till we see the frequency which is there so if you go ahead and change that don't forget to leave space uh, MHZ in it so if you go ahead and change that so if I cut that out and type I don't know 430 decimal 000 space MHZ just put your mouse on the next one touch on it I've now changed that to 430 decimal 000 and once you've done once you've uh, finished editing it uh, put your screen I don't know how you guys are going to update it but I use the USB to TTL converter so if you stick the uh, USB to TTL converter into your laptop or computer you then go up to upload it won't do it on my case because it's not there uh, and then you just go to go and re-burn the image back up to your screen so that's all you do is you just touch your mouse on but you have to do it don't forget on each page that's D star DMR fusion P25 you're gonna to have to go through and change them all for all five screens all five screens up here so you go touch on the main one that's your idle screen your D star screen uh, then you'd have to go down so D star move across to that touch your mouse on there scroll down to if I grab it I can't hold the screen there you go that one change that to 430 decimal 000 then move up to the DMR one move your mouse across to that one again and all the way down to here and by the way while we're actually doing this this is where you can change the color so up here if you touch on that there are your base colors so you've got gray background and you've got yellow text so the text in there will be yellow so if you wanted it blue you put your mouse on here and you get a list of colors and you change that to blue and then the text box in there when it when it transmits your RSSI will be blue on grey uh, but this is how you do it with all the colours uh, same here I've got that yellow it's grey on yellow this one the text box up here which I've highlighted it you move it down there that is black on yellow so this is how you change all the options on the screen uh, using the Nextian editor and um, once you've finished go to upload and if you've got the screen plugged into the computer you just click go and then it will burn the image re back to the screen hopefully that helps